Hello and welcome back to our video series on prompt engineering for AI chatbots. As a quick refresher, prompt engineering is the art of crafting inputs to AI chatbots in order to achieve higher quality outputs. Now in today's video, we're going to be discussing the chain of thought prompting technique and how it can be used to unveil the steps taken by the AI model to produce the output you had requested. Okay, first off, let's discuss what chain of thought prompting actually is. Now imagine engaging in a conversation with an AI bot, not just asking for answers, but understanding how it arrived at those answers. And this is the essence of chain of thought prompting. At its core, it involves instructing the model to reveal the steps it took to reach a particular conclusion. Instead of treating the AI as a black box, we open it up, making the decision-making process more visible and understandable. Now this can be valuable when working with complex queries or seeking nuanced responses. Consider it as having a dialogue with the AI, prompting it to narrate its own train of thought. This approach not only facilitates better transparency, but also enables users to catch and correct any potential inaccuracies in the AI's reasoning. Okay, let's shift over to Microsoft's Copilot for a few demos. Okay, so I got my first prompt here and it reads, I'm looking to purchase a new cell phone. I need something with good battery life. What do you recommend? Please provide me with your top three recommendations. Let's see what we get here. Okay, so we got some recommendations coming through. It's definitely an emphasis on the battery life as we mentioned in our prompt that was very important to us. So that's great to see the models picking up on that. But suppose we wanted to unveil um, the process um, that the model took in order to come to these recommendations. So we could follow up with asking, can you please itemize the steps that you took to come to this answer? And here we can see the model used an internal tool called Search Web to submit the following query. Uh, it sourced an article with a laptop mag, selected the top three phones uh, based off battery life and price from that article, uh, pulled in the price for each of those phones using another search, and then created a response to me uh, that reflected the top three phones, the best battery life and the respective prices. Okay, excellent. Okay, for our next example, we're gonna ask, what is the best Microsoft tool for analyzing data and creating different data visualizations like bar charts and line graphs? Okay, so it looks like we're pulling in some tools from a Forbes article. Uh, number one being Microsoft Power BI, so an excellent choice there. Uh, but it looks like some of the other tools are actually not produced by Microsoft, namely Tableau and, and Looker. So not entirely happy with this response. Obviously our initial prompt did specify the best Microsoft tool. Um, so with chain of thought prompting in mind, uh, we're going to follow up and ask, can you please itemize the steps that you took to come to this answer? And maybe we can use some insights here to locate where the model went wrong. Okay, so it used a search web tool to look up how to itemize steps for a process. Okay, so nowhere within these steps does it mention that we're, we're filtering by Microsoft related products only. Doesn't seem like that criteria was taken into account when producing the response. So we're gonna follow up with our model one more time here and say, hey, I noticed that a number of the tools you had listed are not produced by Microsoft. Can you please revise the list to only show Microsoft products? So 
So we get an apology and we can see Microsoft Power BI is still on the list alongside Excel and Visio. So this was a good use case for using chain of thought prompting in order to diagnose faulty responses from our AI chatbots. Okay, and for our last example, let's have a little bit of fun here and ask Microsoft Copilot, I'm looking for a birthday gift for my mother. What do you recommend? Also, can you please itemize the steps that you took to come to this answer? Let's see, we got a pillowcase, a vase, okay, a comb, a very expensive comb. sharing a few links with us. And then, oh, here we go. The steps it took to come up with these recommendations, used a search query, reviewed the shopping search results, so it gets slowing down. Oh, there we go. Selected three ideas, prices. So perfect. We have a perfectly reasonable list of gifts, maybe with the exception of that comb and the chain of thought that the model took in order to produce those ideas. Okay, to summarize, today we dove into the chain of thought prompting technique and unveiled its power to enhance transparency and control in our AI chatbot interactions. By peeling back the layers of our AI chatbot's decision-making, we transformed what would have been a standard Q&A session into a dynamic conversation, one where we refined our responses in real time. By simply asking the chatbot to list the steps that it took to come to its answer, we gained valuable insights into the AI bot's decision-making process and in turn, troubleshooted errors and hallucinations more easily. So that's a wrap for today's exploration of prompt engineering. If you'd like to chat more about AI, feel free to reach out to us at clearconcepts.ca slash AI to set up an AI discovery chat for your organization. Also, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to click the like button and subscribe to our channel. Until next time, happy prompting.